hello everyone in this lecture we'll see how to remember fleming's left hand rule and right hand rule by mean in any interview if somebody is suddenly asking fleming's left hand rule is for motor or generator of course we might be knowing before but when it comes to that situation in an interview when you are facing an interview you may not be able to say instantly you will be confused motor means whether it is a right hand rule or left hand rule we know there are two things one is a generator one is motor so two rules fleming's left hand rule and fleming's right hand rule so how to map we normally get confused here so this video will help you to remember forever you will never forget if you go with this logic let's see to it we know there are two rules mainly in machines one is fleming's left hand rule i am writing in short form fleming's left hand rule and fleming's right hand rule and we know one is for motor another one is for generator so how do you link let's write here i am writing motor motor and generator if you see in case of motor one r is there among these two this is having one r so for motor fleming's left hand rule in case of generator two r's are present here also two r's are present so generator right hand rule so from now i don't think you will get confused you will get stuck in lab viva or you know in an interview why fleming's left hand rule means you can now easily say fleming's left hand rule one r motor one r so fleming's left hand rule is for motor thanks for watching the video if you like please hit the like button and please share your valuable comments which helps us to improve the quality of the lectures to get more updates like these tips and other interesting things in electrical engineering please do subscribe to our channel 